Hello, I would like to describe briefly what happens on the day that you undergo a laser procedure called iridotomy or iridectomy. This is a procedure that we, the eye specialists, the glaucoma experts, perform for narrow angle glaucoma. It's a prophylactic or a preventive measure, so you don't have a problem now, but your eye doctor can examine you and say, you are at risk for developing a problem in the future that is so dramatic that we would rather do a laser to prevent it. So you're here in my office for the second time and today the procedure will take place. After a few questions and answers, I will perform or actually repeat the examination just to make sure that nothing has changed and it never does. And then explain to you in a few words what the procedure is all about and each one of my patients will sign a consent after verbally letting me know that he understand, he agrees, and he would like me to perform the procedure. Next I will put a few drops that shrink or constrict the pupil. That's something technical that may assist in performing the laser. And after 15 or 20 minutes the patients will be taken to the laser room. There you will be seated in front of a machine which is very similar to the slit lamp that sits in the center of every eye doctor, in the center of the room, where the only difference is that this laser machine has a fiber, an optical fiber, that transmits the laser energy. And this is actually the light that will enter your eye, the patient's eye, and help in performing what the laser is supposed to do. Next, I will place a contact lens over the patient's eye, which assists me in several things. It helps me see the inside of the eye in focus much clearer, and also holds the patient's lids open so that the patient does not need to worry if he or she needs to blink or move the eye because I'm in control and I'm holding the eye. Next, I will press the laser button and shoot a few shots that will do what the laser knows to do best, and that is perform a microscopical hole in the iris of the eye. That's the part of the eye that has the color, whether you're blue-eyed or brown-eyed, that's the iris. This very small hole will not be seen by anyone looking at you because it's really, really tiny. It's smaller than the tip of a needle. And number two, this laser procedure will not be painful. That's not to say that you won't feel it. It's very often that you feel a prick or something touching your eye for a split second, but it's minimal pain and you can tolerate it and there's no need for an anesthetic or, or general anesthesia or anything like that. It's, it's a mild discomfort, in my opinion less than when you have blood drawn or something like that. After the laser is finished, you will start putting drops for about a week, drops that reduce inflammation and will help heal the eye from the procedure. Once the laser is finished, you will sit outside for usually 15 or 30 minutes and then I will see you again just to make sure that the eye is still there. Uh, after confirming that everything is okay and it always is, you will go home and next time I will see you maybe in two, three or four weeks to think about what else can be done to improve your condition and to keep your eyes as healthy as we can. What I have remaining to say is good luck and all the best.